So if you simply look at the volume of data that's going, the volume that's going over the intertelecommunication networks, it's primarily content movies, video clips and movies and such like. On the other hand, when you look at the value of communications, what people really care about, it's relatively low bandwidth, typically mostly one, one on one, one to a small group of people communication. And this is harder to do now, but say about 15 or so years ago, in the era when you had to pay for each text that you send and you paid by the minute for phone calls, I actually had some nice statistics I would show in my presentations showing this inverse relationship between the price people were willing to pay and the value and the volume. The texts were really by, by far the highest, actually ringtones were even higher, the texts, voice and video also the very bottom. So yes, people access a lot of content that generates a lot of traffic, but that doesn't have much value. So therefore, all these plans to try to fund the net telecom networks by somehow taxing the distribution of content are delusional. 